You know, often when we're young, in our youth, you know, teenagers, young 20s, we get into this phase of trying to be whom we feel we have to be or need to be to get the people whom we want to like us, to be cool with us, to gravitate to us. We get into this phase and this habit of doing what it takes to remain in the in crowd, to be popular, um, to be in fashion, you know, while at the same time, unknowingly, we are denying whom we are personally, who we truly are as an individual. And I mean so like who one is or who I am in regards to what I was created to do here, you know? In trying to be in the in crowd or to be with those that's popular or to be in fashion or, you know, to be amongst the individuals that one wants to be amongst. We typically get caught up in a phase of being someone whom we're not. And some of us are blessed and fortunate enough to grow out of it and in enough time to recover and truly learn to love self and grow into that and flourish and become successful and truly be happy and at peace because you're existing in a true state, you know. But most unfortunately don't and it's just a gamble to be aware of this and don't do what's necessary with the time that you have right now to make the changes that need to be made like right now so that when I do or you do reach that level of success that you desire that you're able to truly enjoy it you know because to get there and not be true to you but to be who you believe you have to be in order for people to like and love you will leave you not really being happy at all not being happy with self and you'll find that you can never truly please people. So you'll find that whatever you do and whomever you try to be for them will never be enough. And so the true happiness and success can only be found and explored and established with one truly embarking upon a journey of knowing who they are as a person, knowing who you are in relation to God, and knowing what the enemy is, what the enemy looks like, what the characteristics of the enemy is, because when you don't know what your enemy or who your enemy is, when that enemy comes in front of you, a lot of times we find ourselves also hurt and at loss because we trusted an individual whom we shouldn't. We tried to please an individual we shouldn't. We got lost in all of the things that we got lost in, all behind interacting with someone one shouldn't have been interacting with in the way that one was interacting with that person, you know. Just learn who you are and be great. Find greatness in who you are.